Colin Nervy tense atmosphere now. One of Quinn's got up their sleeve. Smith with that little jump again that he likes. Oh, he's going to get there as well. A couple of times Eastman's buckled him up, but not on this occasion. Just a slight overchase on the outside, and Eastman can't do anything about it. Gets on the outside. Back to Smith. Advantage to the fullbacks. Oh. Moenga. Well, that's one way of getting the ball to several Reese. Oh. It's a wonderful piece of skill. This is it here from Richie Mwangi. It looks to kick long, it changes his decision, and then a stop goal from Severis leaves Mapimpi for dead. He's that made more carries forward. on this tour than Tom Curry. And he's made a lot of tackles today. Will it be enough to get that number seven shirt? Look at Smith go here. And a bit of Reese Lightning from Luis Reese Samet. Just an in and out. Bang. The jump goose that Wiseli Serevi started all those years ago. Once he gets on the outside, it's a lovely two on one. It's nice when you set sail. But it's not offside. Look at the way Aaron Smith, in fact, he was offside. And here's a chance for Tim Lanai Williams. I've guessed him. Tim Lanai Williams. What a reply from the Chiefs. He's gone too wide. He can't go outside of the five metres of the scrum. Nonu rushes up, that's poor defence from Nonu and Burley. The, look at that goose step, Campisi style would be proud. And he gasses Ben Smith on the outside, sensational finish. Well here, you'll see Martin Nonu turns, he's gone as you said, over committed and then he just had the fullback to beat. Puts the hammer down, he's getting the raspberry from the crowd. But that is a wonderful piece of individual brilliance from Tim Nonu Williams. There's a chance for an overlap. Murphy again, Martin Williams, out to Shane Williams. Both wingers have touched it. Can Shane Williams score? Jordan Murphy to Williams, but he's comfortable. That is a glorious hitch kick. All right. Now Cowan again, Dag. Dag. Beautiful run, Israel Dag. Still going. Israel Dag. Let's look at it and admire it. He shows the ball, he fends, he steps, the speed, brilliance. Individual try, a team effort to get him in the position to do what he does best. Marcus Smith calling for it out wide. Hitch kick and he flies through the gap. Ridiculous skills. He's got Louis Liner in support. Here comes Liner. Liner sidesteps one way, then goes the other. Joe Simmons isn't going to catch him. Brilliant from Marcus Smith. Rounded off by Louis Liner. And Harlequins back in it with try number four for them under the post. Galloway decides to give it a crack, long last, gives the ball to Flowers, just to have a look at this. Fantastic step, swerve, everything, balance, quality of the man for now. Yeah, good finish. Playing a lengthy advantage, Carter slings it wide, now Dag in a bit of space, off he goes. And he got the pass off beautifully, Kahui again, Kahui lining up, Kahui still going, and he's got two. looping round, They're using their forwards often standing in the middle of the park, trying to take play there to give themselves options either side, but at times they'll cut to the defensive line, and Carter will loop, that's exactly what they did there, Tonga defence was drawn in, Dag, well a Sunny Bolesk backflip, backhanded pass, Kahui lots of support on the inside, but he did it all on his own. Yeah, it was the Yongi really, wasn't it, and the Tongan winger who came in. But they talk about Grant Fox, the competitiveness in the back three for the All Blacks. There's three here tonight, making some sort of statement. Preston breaks away, Serevi. There's that characteristic dummy, and the hitch kick, and Serevi is away, he needs some help. I don't know that he's got the pace to go all the way. Terrific support. Oh, he's got to get the hat-trick. And he really has deserved it. Point in there. Watch this lovely play from Serevi. 
for his space, shows Graham Shuler dummy, but it's that hitch kick, he finds his space, now watch how easy he steps off his right foot. I'm not sure they want to see him again in a competitive situation, but that's the little characteristic hitch kick that has enthralled Seven's audiences all around the world, and the magnificent sidestep, and he had to get the pass right, and he did it.